Death and Burial of Percock Robin by H. L. Stevens. This is a LibriVox recording. All LibriVox recordings are in the public domain. For more information or to volunteer, please visit LibriVox.org. Recording by Chad Horner from Ballyclare in County Antrim, Northern Ireland, situated in the northeast of the island of Ireland. Death and Burial of Percock Robin by H. L. Stevens. Who killed Cock Robin? I, said the sparrow, with my bow and arrow, I killed Cock Robin. Who saw him die? I, said the fly, with my little eye, I saw him die. Who caught his blood? I, said the fish, with my little dish, I caught his blood. Who'll make his shroud? I, said the bee, with my thread and needle, I'll make his shroud. Who'll dig his grave? I, said the owl, with my spade and trowel, I'll dig his grave. Who'll bear the pole? We, said the wren, both the cock and the hen. We'll bear the pole. We'll carry him to the grave. I, said the kite. If it's not in the night, I'll carry him to the grave. Who'll be the parson? I, said the rook, with my little book. I'll be the parson. Who'll sing a psalm? I, said the thrush, as he sat in the bush. I'll sing a psalm. Who'll be the clerk? I, said the lark. If it's not in the dark, I'll be the clerk. Who'll be chief mourner? I, said the dove, because I mourned for my love. I'll be chief mourner. Who'll carry the link? I, said the linnet. I'll fetch it in a minute. I'll carry the link. Who'll toll the bell? I, said the bull, because I can pull. I'll toll the bell. All the birds in the air fell to singing and sobbing when they heard the bell for poor Cock Robin, while the cruel Cock Sparrow, the cause of their grief, was hung on a gibbet next day like a thief. End of Death and Burial of Poor Cock Robin by H. L. Stevens. This recording is in the public domain.